Hi guys, I'm Megan and you are watching What's in My Fridge. Today we are making firecracker cakes in honor of the 4th of July. It's about to get real patriotic up in here. But first and foremost, let me introduce my firework of a guest, Bryn from Bindle Beauty X. Do, 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 she's a firework. Get it? It's like a 4th of July joke. Do you want to grab the cake mix out of the cupboard? Because we're no longer using the fridge. <laughs> oh look, I put it in that one. Yay! So before we get started on cooking this up, let's put our aprons on by snapping. So one, two, three. So now that we have our aprons on, let's get started on the cake. Do you want to grab the bowls? Grab all of the bowls. Mm -hmm. And look how cute they are and so festive. So to make this 4th of July themed, we are going to be breaking up the cake mix into three different sections. We'll have a red, a white, and a blue. So we're gonna start by making the whole cake mix in the big bowl. So what's your favorite kind of cake? Uh, probably chocolate, just because chocolate's my favorite kind of everything. I thought you were gonna say chocolate's your favorite color, and I was like, uh, that is dedication. <laughs> chocolate would be my favorite color too. Okay, cake mix, water, oil, and egg whites. You wanna take care of the oil while I go get the eggs out of the fridge. Now that I have my bowl, I'm going to crack three egg whites, and I'm just going to separate them in this bowl right here. Whee! So now we're gonna pour the egg whites into the cake mixture, and then we're gonna work our biceps. I'll take the first shift. Do you wanna talk to me about your 4th of July plans? What are you gonna do? Um, 4th of July is like pretty big in my town, so like everyone just kind of rides their bikes around and we have a big parade, so. I feel like I've gotten this pretty, pretty well stirred, right? Yeah, looks that, good. That looks, that looks like a thing that I made. So now I'm gonna pour this out into these two other bowls so we can dye it red and blue. So let's split this up. You've got blue, I've got red, and then they're gel food coloring, which is cool. So we're yeah. gonna take Nice. Looks like jelly. I'm going to stir in it in. Oh my god, they're such pretty colors. I know, it's really vibrant. It's really vibrant. So we've got them all mixed up. Mine's red. Mine's blue. And then we've got the white ones. We've got red, white, and blue. So I'm gonna put those in the oven for about 20 minutes and then I'm gonna show you what they look like when they come out. Okay, so this is what it looks like when it's done, and we've already cut them into these little circles using this cookie cutter. And what we're gonna do now is we're going to frost them accordingly to their matching color. So what we're gonna do is we're going to frost the red ones with red icing and the blue one with blue icing, and then sandwich them all together. So now for the fireworks part, we're actually going to take Pop Rocks, and to be honest, my favorite are the blue ones. I'm a fan of the blue too. You are? We're literally food twins. So we're actually gonna pour these in the center of this. And once we have those down, we're going to sandwich them all together. Okay, white goes on top of red. And then top it off with the blue one. So finally, to make these look even more like fireworks, we're going to stick these little pieces of black licorice that we cut from just regular pieces of black licorice, and we're gonna stick it in the middle. So now with tender love and care, <laughs> we've got it. If you wanna do this for a party, you can definitely stick like toothpicks in it to keep it all staying up until you eat them, but for now, we're just gonna chill it with like this. So mine really fell apart, but this one, it, it's hanging on. It's it's mediocre, but you know, not exactly like the tender love and care we spent to make this one. Ah. So just ignore this. <laughs> this one's the pretty one. Ooh. So despite the fact that this one doesn't look as nice, I think this is the one we want to taste yes. because it's like all cakey and goodnessy. So do you want to try a bite? Okay. <laughs> Take a bite like a burger. It's all you, girl. Okay. It's all you. If I could, I would. I'll catch your prompts. Thank you. It's a team effort. Yes. Oh, is it good? Mm-hmm. Good. Good, right? Mm -hmm. It's popping. Is it weird? It's weird. Do we like it? I do. It's like a firecracker. It's like the 4th of July it in your really mouth. It really is, yeah. Okay, guys, that's it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you, Bryn, for being a guest. Thank you for having me. Of course. If you guys want to check out her channel, I'll have all of the links in the down bar. Make sure to leave in the comments down below what your plans are for the 4th of July, because we want to know. I'm Megan, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.